Well, well, what's going on everyone? RC84 here, like always. Thanks for watching. So my friends, today I'm doing a little bit of hurricane proofing. Uh, if you've been watching the uh, the Weather Channel, the news, you've been hearing about this uh, this hurricane that's hitting Florida right now. And uh, it's coming up the coastline. Uh, it's going to hit North Carolina, which is where I live at, on the coast of North Carolina, by the way. <laughs> uh, and they're saying by the time it hits us or gets here, um, it's going to be a uh, tropical depression or you know tropical storm really uh, so we won't see as much as an impact of florida is seeing right now in the bahamas and stuff like that they're seeing major you know amounts of of uh you know they're feeling the full effect of it uh so by the time like i said the time it gets here it's going to be a tropical depression so we're going to have some heavy rainfall we're going to have some wind they're talking about winds about 40 to 50 miles an hour at most uh, but we'll see, you know, they, they, they're saying right now it's just really too early to tell which way it's actually going to go. Uh, you know, you can't really predict a hurricane. Like, you can kind of figure out, like, try to figure out where it's going, but you're not going to really predict it. You don't know it's really the path. It could just, at a spur of the moment, it could take any direction it wants to go, just depending on the current conditions and stuff like that, but... But yeah, I've been uh, doing a little bit of hurricane prep, you know, just tying down some things, getting some stuff down that uh, might blow away and stuff like that during the winds. The, uh, the one thing that I am kind of worried about is, of course, back here. Uh, as you may know or don't know, we have that beaver issue again. Uh, it got resolved for a few months and then the beavers came back again. So, uh... That is one thing. So the uh, the trapper did come out. He put out four traps. He's coming back on uh, Thursday to uh, check the traps and knock down some of the dams to allow that water to you know flow through. So hopefully it won't flood back here bad or anything. Hopefully it doesn't really flood up too bad or whatever. Um, we just kind of have to see what's going on. And uh, I'll try to keep y'all updated updated on the uh, progress of the storm and everything let you know if anything gets damaged around here or if the park gets damaged or the site gets damaged that's what it, we're kind of worried about me Jake and Jonathan are worried about the site uh, because we spent so much time in this thing and if this place gets flooded it could potentially wash out a lot of stuff that we've done in the last three months <laughs> but um it is what it is you know if it gets messed up we'll just rebuild you know that's what we do so what you do in construction you rebuild you build and you rebuild and that's what we'll just have to end up doing is just rebuilding uh, as far as the park goes my crawler park um, that's that's to say you know it, it is what it is nothing is really gonna go anywhere but it's mostly rocks and everything it's like there's uh, already you know kind of screwed and nailed down and stuff like that so nothing really have to worry about this you know the park other than my border lines which they are uh they're kind of staked down as well so i don't really see them going anywhere but they do hey it's it is what it is i can get more stakes you can see <laughs> um but yeah you know just some preparations to make sure that uh everything's okay but i think the site is uh site gonna be okay i think i think it is gonna be all right you know, my timber wood, that's the one thing I'm kind of worried about is that I don't really, if it does flood back here, I really don't want those to kind of flood away. But I don't think so because they're, uh, a lot of them are, uh, I got them uh, staked down, uh, wedged between two stakes and stuff. So I don't really see them floating away. And they're pretty heavy as well. So, you know, we'll see, you know. But uh, anyway, I just wanted to let y'all know that uh, about the, uh, a little hurricane tropical storm that's going to hit us uh hopefully like i said it won't be too bad for us hopefully we'll uh make it through with no damages and stuff like that which will be great uh of course there's going to be some cleanup from all the debris and stuff like that i definitely know that some tree limbs are going to fall and stuff like that because i can see some dead trees and stuff like that which is probably a good thing to clear out all that dead uh dead trees and branches and stuff but We'll see about the site and see about this, you know, my, uh, my crawler park and, uh, 
your fire trucks. That's been going on all day. Uh, there's been numerous wrecks and stuff like that. It's just crazy. People here don't know how to drive. I'm, I'm not the best driver whatsoever, but still I have common sense uh, when to pull out, when to not to pull out. And uh, I know that's what she said, right? <laughs> but I, I know, you know, I know what to do, what not to do and stuff like that. Some people just don't know what to do. Some people are such in rush to get somewhere and stuff like that. But, you know. It is what it is. All right, my friends. So I just wanted to uh, get on here, give y'all a little update about the site and what I've been doing to kind of prep the site, keep it down and stuff like that so I don't lose anything. Will I lose any dirt? Uh, yeah. But anyway. All right, my friends. Well, thank you for watching, and I will see y'all later.